Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review A Manifestation of Monsters, Examining the Unusual Suspects by Dr. Carl P. N. Shooker, and this is a book of cryptids, and takes a look at all kinds of different creatures here with this wonderful cover art of Loch Ness Monster, and the Giant Squid, and the Mothman, and Sasquatch, and Chukacabras, and Dodos, and coelacanths and all kinds of stuff and basically how like I recently read this encyclopedia of cryptids this is more a series of essays from Shooker who takes us through a wide range of different kinds of creatures and each of these essays is a mixture of evidence based like this is what we know this is what we can confirm and also accounts and also throwing in some interesting quotes that deal with each of these and, and um, adding some layering into the story of it. And this book is like, I don't know, like 177 pages. It's a relatively quick read, too, um, for something that deals with a lot of essays from a doctor. It's a pretty flowing read. It's not like a super easy read in terms of like, the language and how it's written, but in general for something that feels more technical essays, it is has high readability and it also has obviously interesting topics for all these crazy creatures and it kind of sets the stage, tries to give you context and tries to help you understand how these came about being like mythological and capturing the attention of people um, trying to give you an expectation of where things lie in terms of whether these really exist. Because, like, obviously some of them exist. A giant squid is real. We know this. And some of them, obviously, it's like Mothman. Does Mothman exist? Um, Jersey Devil, does Jersey Devil exist? And you have all these different layers of, here's a story, it sets the stage with, Here's a new creature, here's some quotes to kind of set the stage, and jumping into an essay that's probably like between four to six to eight pages long for each of these creatures, if that, some of them are a little bit shorter, and giving you a sense of the history and the existence of these creatures, and it's engaging, it's interesting, it's not going to blow you away, it's, the voice is not the most engaging and charismatic, but it does present things in a well-structured, easy way. There is a bit of lack of structure in exactly how they lay out all the essays. It kind of just feels like at random. But, you know, I feel like this is the kind of book where it's like you could jump to any chapter and just kind of read that if that's what you're interested in. It doesn't necessarily have to be a cover-to-cover -cover read, but I did enjoy it and I would recommend it if you're into cryptids and all kinds of stuff like that. But those are my thoughts on A Manifestation of Monsters. Let me know what you think and let's talk some books. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wayslam Reviewer.